Let's pick the gradient tool from right here and create a gradient like this. Can you see the banding? No? Let's make it more prominent. Click on the adjustment layer icon and then choose curves. Take the left slider to the right and the right slider to the left to increase the contrast. And there you have it, your hard banding. So how do we take care of it? First way is going to image mode and changing the image from 8 bits per channel to 16 bits per channel. Now when you do that, the banding still doesn't go away. You know why? Because we already created the gradient and it's burned to the pixels. It's not an adjustment layer. So let us choose the gradient tool again. It's already chosen. And now let's create the gradient again. Have a look at it. The banding is gone. However, at some point, you would want to save it as a JPEG. And you know what? If you go to File, Export, and Export As, and if you choose a JPEG from right here, JPEGs only support 8 bits per channel. So you will see banding no matter what you do right here. So how do we finally fix banding while creating gradients? Let's hit Cancel for now. And just for illustration, let's go to Image, Mode, and make sure it is 8 bits per channel. All right, and we will create the same gradient again. Now, if we turn on the Curves Adjustment layer, you see the banding. However, if you check this, the magic of Ditha, see what happens. Let's check this and now create the gradient again. Have a look, the banding is gone. This time it is still 8 bits per channel. How did the banding go away? What is happening? Take a closer look at it. What Ditha does is that it introduces a noisy blend between colors. So here's the before. Here's the after. So when you zoom out, it gives us the illusion that there is a nice blend. If we create an adjustment layer, it would be much clearer to you. So let us pick the same gradient tool. And in the later versions of Photoshop, you would have the option of choosing a gradient and a classic gradient. If you choose gradient, it will create a gradient adjustment layer. So now if you create a gradient like this, it will let you change the colors of different points, let you move the midpoint, so on and so forth. And the best part is, this is adjustable, this is real time. So right in here, if we uncheck Ditha, this is how it looks. Now, as soon as we check Ditha, see, it creates that noisy blend. By the way, you can also create a gradient adjustment layer from right here as well. If you click on the adjustment layer icon, you can choose gradient fill and it will create the same gradient fill layer. You can choose whatever gradient you want, hit OK. Hit OK again. Here you have the Curves Adjustment layer, so it's not clearly visible. But if you're using an older version of Photoshop, that's how to create a gradient adjustment layer. Anyway, the point is, you can go to the properties of the gradient fill anytime by double-clicking on the symbol of the adjustment layer. And from right here, you can check and uncheck Ditha or hit Cancel for now. At the top as well, you have the option for Ditha. Another thing to keep in mind. If you turn on the adjustment layer right here, at some point, you will see banding even with Ditha turned on. So I'm going to increase the contrast too much. And maybe let's add a different kind of gradient. So from right here, let's choose from the top. You can change the gradient. Let's go with this. You can still see certain lines here and there. So I always recommend using a combination of Ditha and going to image mode and making sure 16 bits per channel is checked. Once you do, have a look. It's even smoother. So right now, no matter how many adjustment layers you add, let's add one more Curves Adjustment layer. It won't affect the banding. Why? Because you chose from Image Mode, 16 bits per channel. So too many adjustment layers will not create banding. And also, you chose Ditha right here, which creates a noisy blend. And if you're working with 16 bits per channel, it's even lesser. So two techniques combined will fix your banding issues.